Camp police have launched a search to track down a man who shot and killed a young mother. Family members tell us Raisha Hurd was ambushed and murdered at her parents' home on Kelly Chapel Road. This is Love Hurts. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for future content. Raisha Hurd, affectionately known as Rain, was beautiful both inside and out. Known to be the life of the party, she definitely knew how to have a good time. She was popular, outgoing, and loved by so many people. She had the kind of smile that would light up an entire room. She had two children, and sources say she was pregnant with a third. Although Rain was known to live it up, her love of family is what truly set her apart from most. Family was absolutely everything to her, and her children were her entire world. Rain was in a relationship with Justin Lewis, also known as Mad Music Cali. He was a Louisiana rapper that was known basically for pulling up on celebrities and freestyle rapping for them in an attempt to get signed or to gain publicity. Little is known about how long Rain was dating Mad Music Cali, but at some point things turned contentious. On the afternoon of October 11th, 2023, Rain pulled up in her parents' driveway. With her eight-year-old son still in the back seat of the car, she got out and began removing groceries from the trunk. That's when folks say Mad Music Cali allegedly walked up to Rain and shot her multiple times while her young eight-year-old son watched. Police have been reluctant to name Mad Music Cali as the shooter, and this set Rain's family off, mainly because a lot of family members were present at the time of the shooting, and they know exactly who is responsible for it. Police have launched a search to track down a man who shot and killed a young mother. Family members tell us Raisha Hurd was ambushed and murdered at her parents' home on Kelly Chapel Road. Fox News' Angelique Proctor has the story from the neighborhood where the shooting happened. The Hurd family has lived here on Kelly Chapel Road in DeKalb County for more than 40 years. They have lots of fond memories, but they will never forget what happened here Wednesday night. DeKalb police say someone ambushed mom Rashida Hurd as she and her family were getting out of the car and started shooting. The gunfire was so pronounced it could be heard across the street where Yolanda Bethea lives. It was six shots. I knew it was a gun. I knew it wasn't a firecracker. The next time I looked out the window, that's when I started seeing the police cars and um, the ambulance and stuff. We saw evidence of the violence, a bullet hole in the rear of this white Lexus parked in the carport. Family members are so devastated they are too upset to talk about the murder. Sources close to the investigation tell us Rashida was pregnant and her eight-year-old son watched in horror as his mother was gunned down. Yeah, it is. The bold violence has just stunned neighbors. And we have two small kids here, so I was like, not in our neighborhood. I just, you know, I didn't think that would happen in this neighborhood. Angelique Proctor, Fox 5 News. Allegedly, after the murder, Mad Music Cali hit the road and was on the run. But while running from authorities, apparently he had time to log into his Instagram account because he was on the app heavy, heavy. In one IG story, he wrote, going in tomorrow, hinting towards the fact that he was going to turn himself in the following day. Rain's family believed that he was trying to gain following and clout off of the murder. And I would agree, which is just sick on so many levels. I mean, who murders a woman in front of her children and then post on Instagram for likes and follows? They say fame is a hell of a substance, and clearly they are right. County family still reeling after someone shot and killed a young mother in the family driveway. It happened on Kelly Chapel Road. Raisha Hurd's family tells Fox 5 her eight-year-old son watched it happen. Fox 5's Angelique Proctor joins us live from DeKalb County tonight. Angelique, Hurd's family spoke to you. Why, why did they say they're so frustrated with the process? Well, good evening to you both. Family members and friends say they are frustrated because there has been no arrest and they say they know exactly who did the shooting. And even more upsetting, they claim the shooter has been on social media many days since the murder. 
and I just feel like I just want justice for her. Justice that Raisha Hurd's best friends say is coming too slowly. The young mother of two boys, who's described as the life of the party, was gunned down, DeKalb police say, in her parents' driveway. Family members say Raisha was getting groceries out of the trunk when someone ambushed her from the side of the family's home on Kelly Chapel Road. They shot her multiple times. Her youngest son, just eight years old, watched it all. Words couldn't explain how um, how bad it, it hurt. For them to have to have witness, witness that is it's just it's unexplainable. It's, it's so hard. Both the family and Rashida's friends say they know who shot her. Keep in mind, several of the family members were at the house when the deadly shooting occurred. DeKalb police say they have identified a suspect, but they are not yet ready to release his name. He's doing a lot on his Instagram. He's tempting this. He's tempting the family. Yeah, he wants to go viral from this. So... Yes, we know who it is. Meanwhile, Raisha's besties, who have known her since ninth grade, say they will miss so much about her. Her smile. She always had a, a smile, a big smile. She she touched a lot of people's lives. She had a, a lot of friends, and she was just so loving and caring. She's a loving and caring person. She's the life of the party. We're going to have a positive, positive, never day. negative. And these friends say they do plan to reach out to DeKalb police to talk with them about this new information about this person being on social media. Finally, on October 19th of 2023, police located and arrested Mad Music Cali. They have yet to release any information about the case, but it is still new and in the beginning stages. So hopefully additional information will be coming out shortly. And as if this case isn't sickening enough, listen to this. Once news came out about Mad Music Cali's involvement in Rain's murder, New Orleans natives started talking and one woman's family named him as their loved one's killer. On May 18th of 2017, 25 year old Sydney Decor was found shot to death in her car. And guess who she was dating at the time of her murder? Yep, you guessed it right. Allegedly, Mad Music Cali. Now this case is very, very new. Um, it just happened. So we are still in the beginning stages of the investigation. So I'm hoping that additional information will come out shortly. Man, I just hope Rain and Sydney's family get the justice that they deserve. And I'm definitely interested to see if Louisiana investigators will look into Sydney's case a little bit closer. Now that Mad Music has been arrested in the murder of Rain, I will definitely keep a close eye on the case and provide updates when they are available. My heart really goes out to Rain's family and to Sydney's family, but for Rain's son, just devastating. That baby will forever remember the moment that he lost his mom. That is just tragic and sad. If you are in a domestic abuse relationship, get out now. Please leave. Even if you have to move states or move cities, do whatever you need to do to ensure your safety. As always, loves, stay safe and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell for future content.